Let's play some chess. We're taking on the Daryl Morley bot. Sounds like he's talking a little bit of trash. We'll see how this goes. I'm going to pre-move my knight. I'm going to guess the next move is there. It is. Most engines like to they'll push one pawn short and then they'll push the other pawn long. So we're going to go here. I think I'm not going to take... Though I could change my mind. Let's defend with bishop. Now I might take. Well, let's see. Yeah, I can take probably. It's going to go after that piece. Let's go here. We'll see what it does. Engine does like to bring out its queen early, so. Go all the way back there. Looking to castle here. It's going to take that bishop. Oh no, it didn't take the bishop. It's going for the queen. Engine does some strange moves. Alright, let's go. I think it's okay. We'll see. I'm willing to trade at the spot. No, it's going to let its queen go through. I'm getting checked there. It's okay. We've got we've got a pen on the queen here. Had a pen on the queen. All right, let's try that. Queen didn't move. We get a queen. Unless there's something I'm missing. Queen is vulnerable sometimes. It's not a large percentage of the time, but it is. That spot will take. Now we're going after the bishop. Okay, need to convert here. Going to force... We gotta watch out, her back row could be in trouble. I'm ahead material, so I'm just gonna start trading. No sense in taking too long there. I'm going after the bishop. Not worried about the pawn. I will be worried. Well, I should be worried about it because the back row. Always got to worry about the back row there. The back row can be dangerous. I got to worry about these past pawns too. Okay. My idea is to get a knight here, a knight here, and then bring this knight out to kick the rook. Not sure that's going to work, but we're going to try it. We go after the rook. Rook has to move. Now we bring this knight out. And of course there's always something I don't anticipate there. Wait, let's just leave that knight hanging. We'll check there. I probably should have gone after the rook. Oh, now it's going to overload. guess I go here. I 
Got to watch out for the past pawns, like I said. Let's go up to the rook. Okay, I think I can work this out here. Let's see. Oh, well, let's take that pawn first. We could take with a knight there too, by the way. Because we have the back row mate. And the engine knows it, that's the funny part. Eventually going to get away there. Okay, we've got this one unless, well, I mean, the Brook could probably defend here, but it's fine. We'll go here, clear up the final pawn. This should defend two pieces. There's two defenders, so I can't go where I want. Let's go here. Engine plan surprisingly well. We're going to go for the check. Whittle it down. Try to set up a fork here. Engine sees the fork. Go after the rook. Okay, now we can get that pawn and possibly do some other stuff here. I'm not worried about the knight getting pinned. All right, let's take that pawn. We've got another check here. No, we don't want to do a check. Let's go for the pen. Whoops, wrong button. That's not good. Wrong button there. I was looking to do something with a knight and grab the wrong button, of course. idea is to be able to kick the other pawn out and not worry about the check. Oops. I meant to go to the other square. I had some, yeah, it's been interesting. All right, let's see. Let's push there. Sorry for the long ending here. There's probably a fork here somewhere. How about we just pin and then push the pawn? Pin is removed. That's okay. We're going here. Oh no. Why do I? Oh, whatever, we're fine. 
We'll just convert to queen and we'll win that way. Idea is to take away spacing and then get the king close. We'll get the king close and we'll finish it off in just a minute here. And that's it. Oh, wait. 